and good morning. Thank you for joining us for Tuesday's Daily Market Review, brought to you by iTrader.com. Iraq plans to reach the oil output capacity of 5 million barrels per day before year-end, fully complying with the OPEC deal. Scottish First Minister Sturgeon has written to Prime Minister May demanding that she allow a second referendum to be held on Scottish independence. The new head of Japan's Sumitomo Mitsui Banking Corps said it is actively studying the acquisition of a US bank. The Aussie dollar pair resumes its positive trading, the SSI is gradually leaning to the oversold area, keeping the bullish trend active for the rest of the day. The euro dollar pair's speculative sentiment index remains inconclusive, although climbing slowly toward the overbought area. Apple continues to climb steadily as the stochastic is signalling buy and the moving averages are giving a bullish signal. The price of crude oil shows sideways trading. The price is affected by stochastic negativity that might push the price lower temporarily. The US trade balance will be released at 12.30 GMT. The Eurozone's retail sales at 10.00 GMT. The Canadian imports at 12.30 GMT. The UK PMI construction at 8.30 GMT. The US factory orders at 1400 GMT and the US Red Book Index at 1255 GMT. Thank you for joining us for Tuesday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here at iTrader, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log into iTrader.com for all of your trading needs. Your personal account manager is ready to answer all of your questions.